Portugal is the world's leading producer of cork. This natural material comes from the bark of the cork oak tree, it's renewable and sustainable. The country's cork exports amounted to 1.2 billion euros in 2023, 75% of which came from cork stoppers. Demand for cork has been growing over the years. Sustainability is the reason why the industry is thriving. We are the only forestry industry where the trees are not cut. The skin of the tree is removed every nine years and it regrows. Cork trees are a carbon sink. For each kilo of cork produced, it has captured 73 kilos of CO2. But the sustainable industry is under threat. Climate change and a dwindling workforce are hampering the sector. Forest management is key to preventing the spread of wildfires as temperatures rise. You have small shrubs, patchy areas where you have the herbs and the shrubs, you have the livestock, and so you decrease a lot the amount of vegetation that is there to burn. And so wildfires are not common in this region. Still, drought and disease pose growing threats to trees. You plant 400 trees per hectare, you know, and after the first summer, if you don't do any kind of irrigation, you can have only 100 trees or less. It's not ready. It's not... Cork harvesting is a craft that requires skillful workers. Mistakes come at a price. This is a scare of the cork oak. When you damage that skin, that part will never give you cork again. Although cork harvesters earn on average 120 euros per day, the profession struggles to attract new workers. The people that knows how to extract cork are older. If we don't do anything to try to teach some young people to harvesting cork, it will get harder and harder to, to find the right people to do, to do this job. Despite this problem, demand for cork continues to grow. Sectors such as construction, design and fashion are attracted by the material sustainability.